I, I, I used to feel so devastated What is going on guys? Edgar here, lifestylesdefined.com. Welcome back. Today's Ray-Ban frame is the Ray-Ban 4228 and this model here happens to be the shiny gray version. Now this pair of shades was specifically designed for men. They are very masculine. As you can tell by the shape of this frame, it is very squared and has a lot of sharp edges just made for the masculine side of my dudes out there so anyway if you're looking for a new pair of shades gents and you were looking to impress this model here is one to go with for sure now shiny gray this frame just has an interesting color combination the front section is made out of propionite which is a light version of plastic very durable very sturdy and light weights and the top or the front finish of this frame is again a glossy gray finish if you look at the temples, which are actually made out of metal or aluminum, uh, these are actually flexible. You can flex these. The frames do not have spring hinges, but as you can see on screen and if you watch me, you can actually see that I am flexing the temples and that will help with flexibility and also will help keep the uh, form of the frames as they are meant to be. Now again, everything that this material is made out of is going to make this frame lightweight. If you look at the temples, you do have the metal on top, but you do have a red finish inside on either side of the temple. So red on the outside here, and then you have a grippy section on the inside that goes all the way back to the ear section of the temple tip. So if you put these on, you'll notice that the red temple tip goes all the way back towards the back of my ears which again is going to allow for comfort and allow to grip my head as much as possible without actually pulling hair or anything like that the front section you'll notice on this here you do have a nice wide bridge here so let's take a look at the dimensions here this particular model is a larger model it is a 58 eye size here and it has an 18 millimeter temple and then as far as the actual temples, and let me just make sure, the temples are 140, so that's pretty standard, 140 millimeters. And again, you can see that it makes it all the way to the back of my ear, which is the act, what you want to make sure of when you get a pair of sunglasses. So again, the shiny gray finish, the lenses are actually uh, gray gradients. So when you take a look at the, these lenses and when you're looking through them, you are looking through a gray pair of shades but these do have a gray gradient finish, which means the gray gets darker towards the top, lighter towards the bottom with the gray glossy finish in the front. And then you have the nice red accent on the sides of this model here. Like every Ray-Ban frame, you do get other options that you can check out. If you go to rayban.com, they have different combinations. The lenses are also available in polarized. These are not polarized, but you can choose the option of going with a polarized version of these lenses and i always recommend that when you go with sunglasses so again as far as customizing the frame you do have a lot of options available now the pricing and just to make sure uh as far as this frame here retail it sells for about 160 dollars and price is always going to range depending on where you buy them i always uh advise you that if you are going to pair uh, pick up a pair of shades that you try them on first before you buy them because it is important to know that they fit properly. You want them to fit properly in the, in the nose area. You want them to feel comfortably on the sides of your head towards on the temple section and you want to make sure that they stay on and if they don't, you want to make sure that they are adjustable. And these happen to be a little bit adjustable but not so much because the temples are flexible and they have kind of that memory uh, form factor you might not be able to customize these uh, too much so if you have a slim head these might not be a good option for you however for me a 58 eye size is going to fit me really well in fact I can go up to a 62 and they still fit me really well but if you're a gentleman out there you're looking for a brand new pair of shades something that's more masculine edgy this is one to go with let me know what you think in the comment section below as always my name is Edgar signing off Peace.